I'm in the van now and I'm praying to God. I said, please God, make me avoid these cells and I'll pray my salah every day. I'll pray my prayers. And if I don't pray my prayers, forget the cells, throw me to jail. Prayed my salah for five days, yeah? The sixth day, I didn't pray. The seventh day, my solicitor gave me a random call. He said, you got an interview to go to in, in Crawley. It's not voluntary. You, they'll arrest you if you don't go. I said, okay, I've gone there with no thought of mine. I'm going to go to jail. So I'm in the cells. I've gone for my interview. They're talking about your mate got arrested three months ago. He's been in jail for three months. We've seen some phone evidence that your phones are together too much. I'm like, no comment. That was my biggest mistake saying no comment. I'm just used to no comment. So I've done no comment, no comment. And what that does now, it deep, makes them dig deeper. They put me back in the cell. Like six, seven hours later, this come to me. He's like, I think you're going to get remanded. The next day, my sister came to me and goes, yeah, you are getting remanded. You're going to prison.